Hi there. We're going to be checking your chest today and we're going to give you a thorough workup and just see if there's anything wrong. You look very, very healthy, so I doubt very much whether that's the case. Now, my colleague on the front desk says that you're a little bit nervous about today's exam. All right, there's no need to be nervous, but what we'll do is we'll make sure that this is, if anything, an enjoyable experience for you, okay? We're going to calm you right down. So, what we need to do to begin with is we need to check your your pulse. So, if you can uh, just, let me just roll your sleeve up. There you go. And I'm just going to place my two fingers on your wrist and I'm going to count to 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, so you can tell that you're nervous. Your pulse is a little bit on the high side. So, we'll do our absolute best to make sure that by the time you leave this exam, you are chill and relaxed. Okay. Now, what I need to do to begin with is I need to take just one or two details. Uh, can I just check your name, please? Okay, good. And your date of birth. Good. Are you taking any medication for anything at all? Okay, good, good, good. General health is okay. You look very healthy. All right, good. Which gender do you identify with or gender neutral or prefer not to say? Okay, that's good. Let's get to it. Okay, so to begin with, I'm going to get you to breathe in for a count of seven. Okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait. Breathe out for a count of eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Didn't quite make it, but that's fine. The whole idea of that is that when you breathe in for a shorter time than you breathe out, it relaxes you. It activates the parasympathetic nervous system so that you feel uh, a little bit more relaxed. So we'll be doing that throughout the test so that you feel a bit more relaxed. Okay. All right. So now what I'm going to do um, to begin with is just if you can loosen your, your top for me. That's great. Now, I'm going to have a look at the um, the general appearance of your chest and uh, the sides and the back as well, um, just to check for symmetry, any obvious lumps, bumps or lesions. So, there we go. If you um, just relax and breathe normally. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, good. I get you to lift your one arm on this side and just have a look see what's going on. Okay, perfect. That's fine. And uh, if you can lift your arm on the other side for me. Again, I'm going to get a little bit closer just to have a good look see. That's perfect. Good, 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 good. good. Alrighty, and if you can turn right around. I'm just going to have a look at the uh, at your back just to see how it looks and if everything is a okay. Okay, that's very good. That's fine. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to put my hands at the bottom of your rib cage. If you just relax, there you go. Good. And I want you, on the count of three, I'd like you to breathe in, okay? So, one, two, three, breathe in. And out. Okay, I'm going to do that again. If you could breathe in for me. And 
and out. All right, perfect. That tells me whether there's evenness and symmetry between the, um, the two sides, but that is fine. Let me just pop that down on my notes. Okay. And what I'm going to do next is I'm going to just palpate between your ribs. This is called the, the intercostal space. Okay. Nothing to worry about. You're doing really well. And I'm proud of you because you're doing very well. And it was a lot to turn up today. A lot of courage it took. So there you go. I'm just going to You can breathe in for me, count of seven. And out, count of eleven. That's great, good. Okay, we're going to palpate the other side. So, uh, same thing. If you can lift your arm up just a little bit for me. And... Good. So there's no fluid, there's no obvious masses or um, uh, any lumps or bumps in between your ribs, which is good. So now I'm just going to palpate the along the clavicle area. So it means me getting in a little bit closer. I hope you don't mind. So here we go. Here we go. I'm just going to palpate just underneath your collarbone. That's perfect. Good. And on the other side, if you look just past me, good, that's great. Good for you. Excellent, 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 excellent. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to work my way down your sternum, so which is the front midline of your torso. So I'm just going to work my way down. Mm-hmm. Okay, that is fine. So far, so good. You're doing very, very well. Okay, now what I'd like you to do next is, this seems a little bit silly and counterintuitive, but what I want you to do is if you can hold your hands out for me like this with your fingers splayed, can you do that for me? Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, that's fine. And if you can do the same thing, but this time, if you can make it so that the fingers are pointing towards each other. So, like this, okay? Yeah, that's fine. Elbows up like that, that's good. And what I'm checking for is any tremors that indicate that there's a, a problem either with your musculoskeletal or respiratory system, but everything seems to be a-okay. All right, that's fine. If you could do the same with your hands, palm upwards, please. Okay, good. And fingers splayed like that. That is fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's looking good. That's great. Okay, that's good. So what I'm going to do next is if I get you to hold your hands out against, again like this, with your fingers splayed, and I'm going to take my gloves off just so I get a better purchase on the, uh, on the skin of your fingers. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take your finger and I'm going to pinch it very, very lightly like this, and I'm going to let it go. And I'm going to see how quickly the color comes back because it goes white when you squeeze it and um, uh, as the capillaries refill, um, it goes back to its normal color. So I'm going to do that with each finger and this is called capillary refill. Okay, you've heard of Cap Bailey. This is Cap 
until we refill. Good. That's good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That is perfect. Okay, let's just do the other hand just for completeness. So, that's it. If you splay your fingers like this for me, perfect. 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 You're doing very well. Okay, good. Okay. That is textbook perfect. That's great. Okay. So, what I'm going to do next, once I get my gloves back on, there we go. Always hate it when the gloves go inside out, but hey, such is life. So what we're going to do next is we're going to check the pallor of your face. Okay. And this tells me whether there's any regions that aren't served well by your, your capillaries. So I'm going to be shining a light just around your face just to get a good look at what is going on. That's perfect. If you just look past my shoulder. Okay, good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That is fine. Good. Okay. All right. Now, while we're here, what we'll do is we'll just check your pupillary response, because if there's any um, issues with the blood flow to the eyes, it often shows up in the pupils. So if I get you to, if you can hold your hand up just between your two eyes for me, and we'll just do the swing test. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can bring your hand down now, and if you look straight ahead again for me, That, my friend, is perfect. You're doing really well. Okay. How are you feeling? Still a little bit nervous. Okay, let me just put my hands on your shoulders and I'll get you to breathe in for a count of seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then let it go for 11. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. 9, 10, 11. Perfect. That's great. Okay, so we're going to check your lymph nodes. So if I get you to um, just look straight ahead for me, I'm just going to put my hands on either side of your neck. Okay, good. And I'm just going to reach around around the back of your neck. That's good. And going to check your post-auricular lymph nodes. Uh -huh. and I'm going to reach around the back of your head. There you go. Good for you. You're doing very, very well. Perfect. Okay. Now, if I get you to lift your chin up a little bit for me, and I'm just going to be feeling your lymph nodes underneath your jawline. Okay, perfect, perfect. And if I get you now to lift both, I'm not going to tickle you. I prompt, well, I might, no, I'm not going to tickle you. Okay, if you can lift your, there you go. I'm just going to have a quick feel just to check the integrity and everything is fine. Okay, good. So, so far, so good. You're doing very, very well. So, let's just pop that down. Let's see what's next on my on my list. Now, what we're going to do next, we're going to check your color of your tongue. Now, okay, if I get you to uh, like that, nice and wide. Okay, I'm just going to pop this tongue depressor down. And, okay, just have a good look around. And uh, it's fine. If you could lift your tongue up to the roof of your mouth, please. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That's perfect. Good, 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 good
that's great. Okay. So, and just need to check your gums here. If you can go like that for me, please. Just bear your gums. I'm going to be lifting your lips out of the way just to check the color of your gums, whether there's any paleness or grayness. But as far as I can see, everything is good. I'm going to do the lower gum line now. So let's just have a look see. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's great. Good, 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 good. You're doing very, very well. Okay, that's fine. Good, good. Okay, so, so far, you are a picture of health, which is always good news. Okay, now, what I'm going to do next is, if I get you to turn your head so that your neck is bared for me, and I want to check your JVP, your venous pulsation in the jugular vein in the neck. So if you can uh, look somewhere over there for me, and I'm just going to be having just a look at the pulsation in your neck. Yep. Alrighty. Nothing untoward there. That's good. We're going to do the other side. So if you turn your head uh, in the other directions, just so you can bare your neck as if I'm a vampire. Okay, so if you look somewhere over there for me. All right, that's fine. And Mina's pulsation is chef's kiss. You're doing good. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we're going to palpate your chest, uh, but we're going to be doing it a little bit deeper this time. And this is to check for any masses or lumps or bumps that shouldn't be there. Okay, so if I get you to... Goosey goosey, just relax and going to be doing it a little bit harder this time. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, and if you can lift your one arm for me, please. That's perfect. You are the best patient I've had all day, that is for sure. Okay, I'm just going to work my way down. Might be a little bit ticklish. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the other side, if you can lift your... There you go, good. And I'm going to come a little bit closer, I hope you don't mind. So, there you go, good, good. Mm -hmm. Perfect. That, my friend, is brilliant. So, let's see what is next on our list. Okay, I'm going to percuss your, your back. So, if I get you to turn a little bit for me, just so you're looking, just over there for me, and just percuss just down the top of your lungs. That's perfect. That's great. You can hardly tell that you're nervous at all. It's like you have this done every day of the week. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to work down the your back on the other side. So I'm going to come a little bit closer. There you go. Good. Perfect. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Okay, that's great. So, what we'll do next is I'm going to have a listen to your heart and your lungs. So, now, this might be a little bit cold, I'm so sorry, but I'm just going to pop this on your chest. I'm going to have a listen to your, your heart, so if you... Just relax for me and... Mm -hmm. Okay, good. That's perfect. I think 
come a little bit closer. healthy. So we'll let, let's have a listen to your lungs. So if I get you to, hopefully this is warmed up a bit. So if I get you to breathe in and out. side. So if I get you to just relax and I'm going to be coming very, very close. So breathe in and out and in and out and in. healthy. You're the healthiest specimen I have seen for a long, long time, so there was no need to get nervous, but I understand why. Okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is if I get you to turn around just a little bit, I'm going to reach around the back and I'm going to cup your waist just underneath your rib cage, And I'd like you to breathe in for me, please. And out. And in, and out. Okay, this tells me if there's any, if there's any difference between the two sides that we need to be worried about. Okay, now, how are you feeling? You feeling okay? A little less nervous? That's great. Okay, what I'll get you to do this time is if you can cross your arms for me like this and kind of hunch your shoulders forward like that. Okay. Now I'm going to be putting my hands, the edge of my, uh, my palms against the midline of your back. Now, when I say now, you say 99. Okay. And this tells me if there's any spaces or gaps, um, cavities in your chest that we need to be worried about. So I'm going to come around the back and you say 99 and again and again and again and again okay perfect I'm gonna come around the other side and do exactly the same thing so I'm just gonna put the edge of my hand against your back and if you say 99 99 99 99. Okay. That is perfect. Okay. So, to finish up, I'm going to check your blood pressure and we're going to check your pulse again. So, I have with me my trusty blood pressure monitor here. So, this is a little bit uncomfortable, but I'm going to just be... this around your arm and it's going to get a little bit tight. I'm just going to pump this up and see. Oops. 
just what your blood pressure is doing. Perfect. 120 over 80. Couldn't be better. And I'm just going to check your pulse again. So if you can just uh, hold your wrist out for me. And I'm just going to be placing my two fingers and counting down from 15. Okay, so 15, 14, 13, 12, 11. is fine your pulse rate has gone right down from the beginning of the uh, of the exam so clearly i've had a relaxing effect on you this is what i'm here for and your chest cavity your respiratory system your heart and your lungs everything is as healthy as could be so i hope i hope i've been of some help today we'll see you again next time. If you have any issues between now and then, come and pay us a visit. Good to see you again. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.